So this is Chen Raisi. He's a rescue. He's 10. Can you turn around and say hi? He's a little stressed out because his mom just left. So I'm going to try to make him as calm as possible and talk to him. It's all right, my love. It's all right, my love. It's all right. We're going to brush him out, do maybe just a bit of thinning. Um, with a senior dog, there are particular things that are a problem for them that you want to work on. Um, one of them is his footing. He has difficulty um, on slippery surfaces. It's a little matted right here. I'm going to thin this out. Let it brush. It's a little matted. So I'm going to make sure I shave his pads good and trim his feet extra good so that none of that hair is there to make his, um, his footing even more slippery. They have uh, stairs to navigate at their house, which causes, you know, an additional difficulty. It's all right, my love. It's all right. It's all right. If your dog is stressed that you're working on, then you want to slow your own breathing and let them feel you so that they feel your energy and that it's calm and then that will help to calm them. <laughs> it's all right, my love. Chen Raisi, mama will be back in just a little bit. She's only gonna be gone for a little bit. You're okay. You're okay, my love. You're okay, Baba. You see here. So as you can see, he has a lot of hair. They've decided to let his coat grow in. He was um, cold quite a bit of the time when the weather changed. She said that lately um, he's uh, shivered less. He's put a little bit of weight on. So I think he has a tiny bit more meat on his bones and that's uh, helping considerably. I want to leave a beautiful long coat, but I do want to take out any spots that are getting a little too thick that are just going to be more problematic than they're worth to brush out and to maintain. So it's not that difficult to keep a long coat. It's difficult to keep a long thick coat, but it doesn't have to be a long thick coat. It can be thin to be whatever thickness you want it to be. Right here is a very sensitive spot, right there in the little loin. And so I am gonna thin that a little bit because it's very sensitive there to brush. A boy. Easy does it. Easy does it. So you'll see it just taking. It's all right. Wow, you're so handsome. You're so handsome, Chinrazy. Chinrazy. The name Chinrazy is means the Bodhisattva of compassion in Tibetan. And he is a Tibetan Lhasa. He was adopted by a Tibetan woman. I think it makes a beautiful story. His original name was Chico, which means little one. He's done really well adjusting to his new home. And, um, and his health has improved considerably. That beautiful coat. Is that gorgeous or what? It really is. He's got just the most outstanding, beautiful golden locks of hair. Of course, he was, had been trimmed short. Probably he was matted when, when he was um, turned over to the, to the shelter that took him in, um, which was is Jelly's place in El Sobrante, or perhaps at Sampa. I believe his mother of 10 years had passed away, and her husband dropped him off at the shelter. I'm not sure of the exact details, but being 10 years old, I don't think they were super confident that they were gonna be able to find someone to adopt him. But from the moment she saw him, his new owner knew that that was going to be her dog. Which is beautiful. He doesn't really like his chest brushed out. So she asked that that be thinned a bit. And I'm noticing that his armpits are matted, so I'm going to shave out his armpits. Easy does it. Easy little man. Easy little man. 
Wow, look at him, he's so handsome. Oh, he's so gorgeous. He took beautiful pictures last time. That's the first time he's looked up at my face. Right there, that glance is the first time he's looked up at me. Beautiful boy, beautiful boy. Even though he's been here for over 20 minutes and I've been talking to him and working on him for 20 minutes, that's the first time he glanced at my face. Almost like it's the first time he even noticed I'm here in the room with him. The only thing he's aware of is that his mother left and he's not happy about that. He um, already turned down my treat. It's all right, my love, it's all right. Wow. But as I said, every dog wants to be told, wow, look at you, wow, wow, look at you. You're so gorgeous, oh my. Look at Chinrezi, he is so beautiful. They really do. They wanna, they wanna wow somebody. Don't we all? Don't we all wanna wow somebody? I think so. He was standing on his own tail, so I did shorten his tail. <laughs> Nobody should stand on their own, have to stand on their own tail. The tail should be light enough it can still have long hair, but it should be light enough that it's a flag they want to wave. That's what a tail is for. It's for wagging and waving after a good trimming. And you make it into a beautiful flag. Oh, they pulled that tail out there. They're so proud of it. Easy does it, my love. Easy does it. Easy does it, my love. Look at that. Wow, look at that beautiful tail. Woo, look at him. just starting to bark when someone comes to the door. She's had him six months now. Um, I, I'm not sure what his life was like in his old life. It's been a, quite an adjustment. And every part of it, he's only gotten to be better and better, stronger, healthier, more gorgeous. That a baby. However, you can see there's a little bit of over attachment to his mom. It's only to be expected. She's, she saved his life. She saved him. And when um, the first time, after she's had him for a couple weeks, he had so much hair hanging over his eyes. And she was standing next to me when I trimmed the bangs away. And she looked into his eyes and she said, there you are. And he looked up at her with the most adoring expression on his face. It was so beautiful. It just, it made the hair stand up on the back of my neck. It was so beautiful. She had been feeding him cheese because his teeth were too sore to eat anything other than that. So we want to trim his feet up really good so that they can find the floor. Easy does it. Easy does it, little man. Good boy.
walk around in the garden. So I think I'm gonna let him take a little break and walk around in the garden. He really likes to explore out there. It's one of his favorite things. I would really like to trim his bangs so he could see better. Can you let me see your bangs? Can I see? All right, well, let's go, let's go walk around the garden and see how that goes. See if that kind of uh, resets his, his stress level.